It wasn't just a bite and we're angry and then we're gonna let go. Because they were there for the, for the kill. An entire family is grieving after their small dog, which belonged to a five-year-old boy with autism, was killed on the Mission Creek Greenway. Almost $4,000 has been raised since the incident, and the family wanted to say thank you for allowing them to properly say goodbye to Cassie. All the money that we've raised is going to go towards uh, a new dog for you, a new uh, therapy dog that can, can comfort him and be by his side again. I'm also going to get my dad some glasses because he lost them in the attack trying to save my dog. <laughs> and we just want to thank everybody. We uh, covered the vet bill. Um, we also gave Kaz a personal cremation. We said goodbye to him today. We said goodbye to him today. The owner of the two large dogs that killed Cassie fled the scene and the dogs were taken to an animal shelter. The dogs will be humanely euthanized after the owner came forward and surrendered them. And they were, I just remember tail kicking the dog. Get up, get up. And my dog just laid there. With his eyes open. <laughs> And looking back, it could have been. Mm -hmm. He walks cats all the time on a leash. So what if, what if he had them? I mean... We look at it in the way that Cat you know, laid down his life for Jaden. Yeah. The outcome people. could have been a lot worse. I mean, we, I still have my son, I have my wife. Yeah. But it could have been... It's just not how you expect your dog No, die. we don't. The family is going to take some time, but said they plan to use the remainder of the money to purchase a new support dog once they've healed. For Castanet News, I'm Alana Kelly in Kelowna. Read letters to the editor in our letters section under the opinion button in the yellow masthead. Email your letters to letters at castanet.net.